We're gonna be ta discussing what's going on with the house, kind of just like Florida updates, just updates with our life because we wanted to update you guys. So we're gonna start off with one of your guys' question. When are you getting your new house? What made you and Bill move to Florida? When is Bill proposing in Florida? Oh, uh, now can you we're say yes or now? Can I ask you right now? What is good, Marvel Squad, and welcome back. Why'd you start without me? Bill and his hoverboard, he is, guys, he is so obsessed with this thing. Every single second, he is riding it. And also, guys, sorry about the lighting. All of our equipment is in our pod that should be arriving actually in a couple of minutes. Hold on, now we can start the video right, babe. Yeah, what I know. If, oh, our pod just our came pod in. Just came in. No. Oh my god, that is so funny, that actually. So we were funny. trying to start this video because our pod, look at it. It's the only pod left on the truck, guys. All look right, at this. guys. We got, we'll be right back. I guess, I guess we'll be right back. Like, this was just, like, <laughs> supposed to be an awesome start of the video, and now we have to wait, in, like, a minute. So, so I'm gonna go out there really quick, and I actually want to show you guys sometime soon. I don't know if it's gonna be in this video or not. We packed this pod so oh god, full guys. of stuff. It's when we open the door, game. it's probably all gonna fall out because of, like, travel and stuff. Right, guys, but I gotta go out there, there yeah. I want to show you guys guys really quick look at how small this machine is when they carry it in like it's crazy that big pod that pod weighs more than a car that little three-wheel machine parks it directly at our oh my god this is insane but what is good marvel squad welcome, welcome back, back to, to our, our channel. channel my god we can finally start now <laughs> yes so as you guys write by the title we're gonna be ta discussing what the title is about and we're gonna be doing an updated q a like the house I, like what's going on with the house kind of just like florida updates just updates with our life because we want to update you guys let you guys know how we're doing so, and what's going on if you are new to our channel make sure to subscribe right now and like this video Yo guys, like this video, give this video a thumbs up because we literally have a home in the works. Like we've yes. we've already put the offer in, they accepted the offer. If you guys don't know this, um, we're actually staying at Bill's parents' Florida house. So that's a little Q and A update right there. It's we've been in Florida for a week. Now. Yes. And we've been in Florida for a week. We survived our we first week out in Florida. And these last two days have been super rainy, which sucks. But we had a really good first week. It was oh, sunny the, the whole, whole week. The whole seven first days that we were here, it was perfect. Yeah. And then Monday and today, being Tuesday that we're filming this, are the two only days that it rained so far. It's crazy. So I prefer the rain over the snow. It's snowing where we used to live in Chicago, and I do not want to go back. Oh, my God. It's only 36 in snow. <laughs> Ew. But, guys, we're going to answer so many of your guys' questions because you guys are always asking us, like, what's going on with the house like this and this and this let's just start off the video um with the first question and it's basically did you guys find a house yet and it's the title of today's video did we buy a house i know they're did wondering i don't think we should make them wait till the end i think no. we should just throw it all out on the plate guys make sure to watch the video all the way through because we have some juicy awesome updating questions yes. and just a lot of insight that no one else knows yet so your guys's questions is did we buy a house so, literally the first week of being down here, we looked at three houses. That's it. That's <laughs> it. And the second home that we looked at, we just instantly fell in love. We loved the well, layout. she loved it more than I did. I love the house. I love the layout, okay? I love that it has a pool and a cage. Obviously, this is not gonna be my like dream. I wanted Obviously. a bigger pool and a bigger cage. But here's the thing. Since we are in a housing crisis right now, we, oh. need, we, we need a home and on top of that, so many houses, I don't know if you guys noticed, have been for sale and they go within days. Second. Like, so we literally needed to put an offer on a house if we liked it, if it was the right home, right away. So yes. me and her came together and we were like, you know what? It has some things that we, we wish were better, but this house Honestly, has everything that we wanted though. It has a garage, has a two car garage, a pool, a cage, a huge layout, three bedrooms and three a, a den. den. Like, Guys, this house is perfect inside and out. The perfect, outside, yeah. the outside's gorgeous. We have some palm trees. We literally have a pool. Guys, and the only thing we're gonna have to fix is the flooring, which um, make we sure you guys are staying <laughs> tuned for our marble vlog channel. We're actually showing you guys a little behind the scenes of the house. We're changing the we're changing the flooring. We have a marble flooring that we're doing, and then. We are um, changing the countertops, but guys. Yeah, guys, if you have not subscribed to our Marvel Vlogs YouTube channel, what are you doing? We already surpassed 200,000 subscribers on our second Insane. vlog channel. Absolutely crazy, but make sure to so stay tuned because we did show what the actual house on the inside looks like. In that, not everything. In we didn't show any room. Like, we only showed the main room and, like, a little but bit still, sneak peek. And the pool. They can get yes. an idea of what it is. Yes. It looks awesome. House tour is coming very soon. Um, But one of you guys' question was, you guys have a pool. Obviously, yes, you cannot have a pool when you're in Florida. I'm sorry. It gets way too hot out here. That was the only, like, yeah. if we were going to buy a house without a pool, we were going to buy a cheaper house without a pool and then build, build a pool. It, Either yeah. way, we were going to have a pool. We, that's no exception. I'm so excited. 
excited for you guys to see it. <laughs> I'm so excited uh, for the content and everything that we get to film in our own house, not woo! being in an apartment. We don't have to apply by anybody else's rules except ours. We are yeah, the homeowners. Yeah, we can jam music. We don't. We literally got two um, violations of loud, excessive music, okay, which okay. I don't even understand. In our defense, we got one. You got two because. You got a noise complaint when I was in Florida yeah, because so she was blaring the music at 2 a.m. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But hey, it's our house now, so we can blare the music. We can talk and scream as loud as we want in our vlogs, and no one can say anything. I know, about literally. It. So we're gonna start off with one of your guys' question. Green a away, Mia said, "When are you getting your new house?" So basically, give you guys a little update. On Friday, we put in the offer, and then on Sunday, we got told that our deal got approved, and they took our deal. The most stressful uh, couple day, no, the most stressful oh my two God, days it's ever. The worst weekend. When you're buying a house, guys, it's probably one of the most stressful things. Yeah. Waiting to hear back and seeing if you got it. We got the paper signed and then it went pending online, which means that it is our home. No one else um, can look no at it. No one else can look at it. If, if everything goes well, we have to get an inspection. Which is happening tomorrow, but we have an inspection. And then I think after the inspection, that's we, when we actually decide, do we want to stay with this house or do we want to, you know, is the inspect? Yeah, but we probably will stay with it. Yeah. And then um, when we basically close and we sign off on it, we get the keys. I guys, know. this is so exciting. I'm so excited for you guys to see the house. It's um, crazy. crazy. I don't know. I, like, guys, you have no idea. This house is like everything that we've ever wanted. And it's in a beautiful neighborhood. And it's just in, and it's in Florida. Like, what better place can you get a house in? We're just blessed that we were able to find this within like the, literally the first week of being here. I know. That is so not we did, normal. We did rush it a little bit only because we had to. There's no other houses on the market. Mm -hmm. There was nothing else that we liked that fit our needs. It has mostly everything that we need besides, obviously, we're changing the flooring and yeah. the countertops. But, Shoot, that's Hey, easy. stay tuned for some Marble Vlogs, you know, maybe Woo! home renovation videos. Yes. Even though the home's already like basically done, we can do some of those. The next question is from Victoria. What was the hardest part about moving? I would say the hardest part about moving was leaving family. Um, the day of our move, I do regret if I could go back and fix it, I would have had the flight earlier in the day because we had our flight at five o'clock and we were sitting around waiting for hours. I liked it though because we can say goodbye, we can hang out. It was too I long. hate getting up and just going like I like well, like you know no like it was a, a couple hours earlier because guys my anxiety levels were so bad I felt super nauseous maybe a two o'clock flight yes like get there by 12 yeah. or something yeah my like, be good. stomach was hurting so bad guys like it was like the most excruciating pain I was nauseous I literally had all these emotions and I did not feel good and I was nervous I wasn't gonna be able to make it on the flight yeah and I'm sure most of you know but if you did not know we lived in Chicago we moved cross country not yes. cross state not cross the neighborhood cross the country we're literally like eight states away from our family mm -hmm. and everything Insane. Comment down below right now if you think that you can move across the country from your family, your friends, your greatest, you know, just acquaintances, everyone, everything, and just leave it all. I will Could say, you do it? sometimes doing things out of your comfort zone, it's gonna, you're gonna see a huge growth within yourself. Like doing things that are out of the norm and things you're not used to, it really does make you branch out and makes you think I a feel different like, way. Yeah, and it I don't know. It's more indep independent. Yeah, I just feel like this move is probably one of the best decisions we've ever made. I'm so thankful to be out in Florida. Like, I love it. I thought I was going to be really homesick, but honestly, I feel very homey I here. I feel homey. And the it's fact like... that we have our house, like, I can't wait to go in there and just start moving in because that house feels so I know. homey. And we have the last piece of the puzzle. Our stuff just literally yes. arrived in front of our eyes. Like, Woo! right now, it's sitting in the driveway and all we have to do is move it around I'm and excited. just get it to our house. Oh my god, I cannot wait. Someone said, are you guys buying a house with a mortgage or renting? So, we are buying a house with a mortgage. Um, we Which don't means really, you own the house. We personally don't like renting. Um, obviously, we rented our apartment, but we needed to do that for ourselves and our business. When you rent, you like it's good. It's not like people say that it's terrible. It's good if that's the only like option that you have. It's good to get like yes. used to living on your own. Yes. But buying a house, you get um, your like, money back. Your after, money back. Yeah. yeah, you could sell it. When you rent, you're just giving someone money, and, and then you never get, get it back. Yeah. They just, you know, they take it. It sucks. So. What made you and Bill move to Florida? Kind what of. What didn't? <laughs> basically, when we to Florida was winters. We absolutely hate summer. I mean, no. <laughs> Winter, we hate summer. No, no, we literally just can't stand the cold because whenever it's cold outside, we're not able to give you guys the best content that we can because we're not able to go outside. We're not we able like, to venture out. We like cars. We're we're. Yeah. Yeah. We're car people and we have obviously our Corvette and we love driving that. We cannot, we literally bought it and then we couldn't drive it for six oh months because of the winter. Yeah, it sucks. We love, we, we just got scooters, we got hoverboards. We love being outside mm -hmm. or just being active. And right here just shows a big reason why we moved here. This is literally where we live. 
There's a dolphins. Yes. We got we got palm sunset trees. palm trees. We got the beaches. Ocean. This is our home, guys. guys like it's just it, we just feel happier. We're able to do more, and you know, it's just it's just better. But some people also, like our friends, we have friends that love the cold, yeah, they I love mean, the cold it's weather. It's all personal preference. We're not, we're not saying anything bad about people who do live in those states. For us, we just personally feel better here. Yes. Lauren said, do you think that this is the house we will live in forever? No. No, <laughs> no it's this not. This house will be, maybe we'll live in there for two to five years. I'm not quite sure how long, but we Dang, for two sure- two years is a long time. Yeah, it just is. Just in two years, we'll be dating for six years then. Oh God, you better, be, you better, better have a ring on my finger then. No, I'm just kidding, I'm just oh kidding, I'm just gosh. kidding. No, that's um, crazy, no, but I, this is not our like dream, like this is our first home dream home. Yeah. Our Corvette was our first car dream car, you know what I mean? Like that was like our like, not obviously that's not our first car, but that was like our dream car. And that, now this is our dream home. Now we, we just wanna, you know. We are just very blessed and thankful that at our age we're able to buy a home. Most people our age don't do that. So we just wanna thank you guys so much for, you know, getting, letting yes, all this happen so because much. this house is so gorgeous and I literally cannot believe we're able to do this at the You at the watching age of our, our videos right now, liking the video, subscribing, yes. watching all the way till the end to show us the max amount of support like helps us so much throughout mm -hmm. the whole process. But also the good thing about buying your first home is you can literally see what things you like and yep. what things you prefer better when you get your second, second home. home which or what things you don't like. I think we're gonna either, we're either gonna build our second home we were gonna build our first home, but the reason why we're not doing that is because we really don't want to stay in our parents' Florida house. It for would take like a year. year. To build. And we just there's so many complications that I we just don't want to stay here. Yeah. Um. That's why we wanted to get our first get our first home that's already built, and then our second home we're either gonna build or if we find a home that you know meets all of our criteria, then we'll we're move gonna move into in. That. Yeah. When is Bill proposing in Florida? Oh, uh, um, I always did say if you're new to our channel, I always did say. That once we get down to Florida, that's when I'm and gonna be. And actually buy our house. Yeah. We're not in any rush. I told Bill, I was like, you know, I'll say yes whenever you ask me, but there's no rush right now. Did we're you say yes right now? If I ask you right now. Yeah. Is that a yes? Yes. I didn't ask you though. So oh well, I'm saying you asked me if I was yes. <laughs> Trust me, I'm gonna let you guys know. I'm gonna do it, and then I'm gonna let you guys know. Bill is doing a it's full gonna, no, it's series. Gonna, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be Bill good. is doing a full series. We've been wanting to do this for like he he already had it planned from like forever. So. Since since we had it was like either twenty or. 30,000 subscribers. I seen someone do a series and I just loved it. I, I love the way that they did it. You capture all the moments. You capture asking my parents, you capture buying the ring. Yeah. You capture just every moment and it just it, it's really cool to be able I want to be able to look back on For that. For people that do it, I actually I do really think it's a good idea. Yeah. So whoever has done it, great idea. I I, I would literally do the same thing. Are you gonna have your friends visit you down in Florida like Jules and Saw and all that? Yes. That's that a is, bad yes. Dude, friends, we already have family, all of our, oh my God. you guys are gonna see so many of our friends coming down. It's super gonna be super exciting. We I have our own house. Them. Like we invited crazy. friends to like Gab and Luke came over yeah. to our apartment, but now we have a house. A house. So we, we can, we can do whatever show. we want. Ooh! We're gonna have we're gonna have a, a friend uh, party. We're gonna have a friends giving. <laughs> the friends get we should. I know. We should set that up, honestly. We fans giving. We should fans, fans giving. giving. Uh, <laughs> okay, how many bedrooms is in your that house? That was such a fake. I know. That was terrible. <laughs> oh my yeah, can we can we do a replay on that? Fans, fans giving. giving. Uh, <laughs> uh, that was a really ugly laugh. She was like a she like ah. Ew. <laughs> Um, how many bedrooms is in your house? We have three bedrooms, two baths, and one den area, like the kind of like an office area. A den is like an office. It's not big enough to be a bedroom, yeah. but it's big enough to be an office. You so could make it into a bedroom if you really wanted basically to. Basically four rooms. Yeah, which is crazy. Huge, more than we needed. What's your favorite and least favorite thing about being in Florida? So my least what favorite. I noticed, huh. Renting our apartment for the same, we actually paid more for our apartment a month than a house. Yeah, I just realized. <laughs> and we get basically four bedrooms, two bathrooms. When our apartment had two bedrooms, two bathrooms. And we get a bigger layout, a pool and a cage for the same monthly price. Yeah. Anyway, my least favorite thing about Florida is summer. I, I don't like when it gets like over 100 degrees. I, you're telling me you like to sit outside when it's 100 Two degrees. Two letters. A, C. Boom, you're probably I solved. get that, but that's my least favorite thing is the heat, the hot, 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 hot heat. My least favorite is the rain, but I will deal with the rain more than the snow. Okay. There's a rainy season here and there's a snowy season at we home. We have different least favorite then. I don't, I don't care. I, I'm, My I'm favorite chilling. thing is literally 
everything. I love the palm yeah. trees. I love the vibes. I love how smooth the roads are when you drive. There's no oh potholes God. or bumps, you know? Because in places that ice comes, yeah. it breaks apart the road. Here, it's smooth. Like, there's no bumps at all. Literally, I'm, it's amazing. Kayla said, when are you going to show us the house you bought? Once we get it closed, we'll keep you guys updated when the closing happens. Oh, we'll and be then all it. we'll be filming everything. Obviously, yeah. we're not gonna show you guys the front of the house for privacy reasons. I we really, really wish we can show you guys the front of the house because it's so beautiful. Yeah. It's oh it's God. insane. It's, it's just insane. it's it's a gray house with white look like white accents, oh. a white garage, white front doors, double front doors. Double front doors. Double front doors. So there's not one front door, there's two front we'll doors. We'll show you guys the front door. Yeah, we'll um, we'll show you like the whole but we will also we already posted on our Marble Vlogs channel or we will post an inside view of the house. Just a little clip it of the master bedroom, bathroom and mm -hmm. room. So I'm you can excited. see it there first before anything. So somebody asked, "Will you have a studio room?" So, yes, one of the bedrooms we're doing it just for like um, yeah, we, all of our bedrooms. stuff. We're actually in the works of something. We're actually going to get it started soon. Well, oh yeah, no, that definitely guys, is going to be like it's, it's going to be like an, a studio office. Guys, just wait till you see what we're about, to, what we're creating right now. It is so cool. I think you guys are going to absolutely insane. love it. We're in the works of it right now. Obviously, we're trying to get this house settled, and then once we're in there, Boom. we're gonna we're you, just wait. Just, <laughs> just be patient, guys. We have to be patient more than anything. Um, does it have upstairs? Florida is more of like a one-story home houses. There's no basements because of hurricanes and flooding. Well, no. no. Oh, there's not yeah because of flooding because yeah. the sea level literally if we dug down below this floor like I think like five feet six feet water. we would hit water because there's water like the ocean there's water it keeps going under the land yeah even though the land is like this high you know it's, it's under yeah there. so we can't have basements. basements there the house that we saw the first house we saw had an upstairs which was so nice until you got into the kitchen we would have bought we would have bought this house if the layout was good the layout was so wacky the pool and the cage was amazing guys it was the wackiest layout the guys but the pool oh. it had two balconies and it had a hot tub guys it was so nice but hey it's okay most houses down here that are two stories are literally probably a million dollars yeah so hey maybe future, future home goals. definitely future goals all right so this is going to be the official last question of this q a is snap comfortable in florida oh my god guys snap is the happiest cat ever and you would think him being a long haired cat that he would shed he would be hot no he loves it we yeah. actually took him for a walk outside we have a yeah. leash for him it was he absolutely loved it guys it was so cute if you guys want to follow my instagram snap that right we actually posted a little clip of him walking outside it was super cute and while you're following him follow me and mariah yes. on instagram because that is where we got these questions we asked you guys questions and those are what we answered <laughs> but if you do not see he's not running around over here because he's at my sister's house yeah we'll be keeping him at my sister's house because some of my family members that stay here are like allergic to like cat hair it's and all sad. that they have like an allergy yeah. so out of respect we'd be keeping out of his house but we do bring him over outside sometimes to like chill out walk around and just you know soak in the Florida vibes yeah he's really comfortable at the Brittany's house like he's able to look outside whenever we do go over there and, and we see him see every him. day yeah we see him every day for he hours he's <laughs> so excited looking at the lizards he, he actually saw his first rain a couple days ago and he oh, oh my, my god gosh. freaks out the, one, right the rain, the harder it hits, the more excited. He like runs around her Literally, house. It's so funny. He loves it. But um, yeah, I think that just, that, does that sum up the question? That sums up the question, guys. I think we answered a lot. Snap will be reuniting with us soon in our big house. You know, just at, good vibes are coming. I'm super excited. I just can't wait for the having our own garage. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. I really I literally have been waiting for this moment for Stay hours. Stay tuned, guys, because this has been the most, I will say, the most craziest two weeks. Like, we, I, I honestly haven't been able to really relax here. I feel like it's just been super stressful and overwhelming. But, guys, this is part of the process. I'm very blessed, and I'm super excited to, you know, get comfortable in our house. One and... week in Florida, and we bought a house. Yeah. One week. That's all it took, guys. That's all it takes. Think about how much we just did. We moved across the country, and now we're buying a house. We had to ship everything out, guys. This is Stressful. And we're filming every day. We love oh. filming. We will we will not miss an upload if we no. can help it. Sometimes on our Marvel vlogs because it's harder sometimes. Yeah, it's, but we are not missing an upload because no. we love love posting content for you guys. Stay and tuned. Making you guys stay tuned. Stay tuned for our vlogs video. We're gonna show a little behind the scenes of the house. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. We do have to give our end of the video post, post notifications. Shout out. 
And this shout out goes to Michael Anthony. So shout Michael out to you, Michael. Anthony. I love that. Two two first names. Yeah, literally. That's awesome. We love you so much, and we hope you guys enjoyed today's Q and A. If you guys have any other questions, make sure to comment them down below. We will answer them in the next Q and A. And give this video a thumbs up, guys. That is how we know that you guys love this video. I say it in every video. Giving this video a thumbs up literally tells us that you guys love the video. Yes. You guys love everything going on. Is that it? That, that sums it up. We'll see, see you guys in the next, next video. video. But, but until, until then, then peace, peace love, love you guys. guys.